I had been spending a lot of time doing computer vision work for companies and bands and fashion labels. Uh, it all involved training a computer to recognize logos in a camera feed. I was getting some decent results tracking stuff and augmenting video, which was great, but it felt kind of like a waste of technology. Then, inspired by projects like Steve Lambert's Ad Art and Jillian Oliver's The Arbitizer, I thought if I could train a computer to recognize logos for the sake of making the brand more ubiquitous, why not train it to erase them completely? So I collected a bunch of logos from the internet and went to the mall to get some logo filled footage and then just started coding. The result is Unlogo, which at the most basic level is a video filter that tries to block or replace logos. But we are also building a web service so that people can upload their videos and have them unlogified. The project is still in very early stages, we've been spending most of our time just getting the infrastructure working. But we're trying to get people interested in this idea of controlling the presence of corporate messages in your videos. They represent an intrusion into the record of your life and we want to provide tools for minimizing that intrusion. Right now you're seeing the logos replaced with the heads of the CEO of the company. The whole project is open source and relies heavily on OpenCV, an open source computer vision library, and FFmpeg, another open source program for video processing. We think the code will also be useful for other artists and hackers doing projects in this space, so we are keeping it free and open.